Hey guys, I'm coming to you from my home office here in Vancouver and I just wanted to do a quick short video talking about the new online workshop that I've put together for you guys. Uh, I think it's a good workshop. Uh, it's quite extensive. It's almost two hours long. It has a lot of material and the workshop is designed for someone that knows a little bit about aquaponics but wants to take their knowledge to the next level. So I want to go into a, a few details about what you can expect in the in the workshop. The workshop starts with an introduction to aquaponics in chapter 1, going into its history, the state of modern aquaponics, and then making a case for what makes it a better choice. Chapter 2 discusses the science of aquaponics, going into the symbiosis, microflora found in aquaponics, the all-important nitrification and denitrification processes. Next, chapter 3 is dedicated to the fish component in aquaponics, starting with why is fish a better alternative, types of fish used in aquaponics, details about tilapia, water temperature, and how it affects growth rates. And finally, ending the chapter with a design example. Chapter 4 is all about water quality. I will discuss nitrogen and its role. Moving into perhaps the most important parameter, pH, and how it directly affects other parameters. Then dissolved oxygen, water temperature, and its relation to pH and water quality. Going into solids and solids removal techniques. And finally, chlorine and chloramines present in water and their effects. Chapter 5 is the largest chapter and there's much being covered here on plants, starting with what you can grow, nutrient requirements, what to look for, and what measures to take to have healthy plants, environmental factors, how they affect plant health. In the last section of chapter 5, I discuss the pests and disease that are common in aquaponics and how to deal with them using biological and natural controls. Lastly, in chapter in the final chapter, chapter 6, I show you methods of different system designs, beginning with backyard systems and ending with a complete design case study for a small commercial aquaponic system. If you like what you saw in the content, I've also put together a small version of the workshop for you to download for free. So go up uh, to the video link up on this page, click that, and then get your small version of the workshop and if you think there's value in the workshop please do leave us some comments below or go onto our Facebook page and let us know what you think thanks a lot I'll see you next time